What do we got here? We have some tacos, beef tacos. Okay. We have guacamole. Uh huh. Fresh rice. And then guacamole. Yep. Then guac. Perfect portion. Yeah. All right. Go ahead. Good. Crispy. Only part about hard shells is that it breaks apart. Father God, thank you for this food. Thank you for letting us have a wonderful time. Thank you for letting our son stay just. Would you continue to allow us to have a good time? And just in the camera. Ni Si Xiao? Ni Xiao? Ni Xiao. Bruh. Ni Xiao. Peanut butter dressing. Very good. Now we got the pork dumplings. This is a kimchi salad. <laughs> Both. Beef. Beef. Pho soup. Okay, this is... Alright, you have a real Korean eating kimchi. Yeah, try it. There's a lot of gochu garu. It's very different. <laughs> it tastes like sour. Here we have the pad thai, Mongolian beef, Zaoshan shrimp. Try it. What should I try first? Yeah, try it. What? Tastes like brutal beef. Creme brulee, Sashin special? Yeah. Good? Sweet. I'll film you. Doing the donut. Oh, it's hot. How is it? Sweet? Oh. Not a lot of hot. Yeah, no, you're smart. Mm. Wow. Yeah, right? Guys, the music at the market at Quivera was so loud, I didn't want to get any copyright strikes, so I'm doing a quick voiceover here. The market is probably the highlight of the resort, as it's a collection of different restaurants based on its uh, cuisine, and if you chose the all-inclusive option, you can basically sit in any of these restaurants and eat to your heart's desire. The first restaurant on our left will be 1950, which is a American diner type of restaurant serving Diner food including waffles, pancakes, omelets, burgers, fries. Next we have El Cocino, which is a Mexican restaurant serving tacos, burritos, enchiladas, and all the fixings. To the left of that we have El Asiatico, which is an Asian themed restaurant serving different rice and noodle dishes including made to order sushi dishes. Next to that we have El Cafe, which is a Starbucks type stand serving different hot and cold caffeinated beverages, soft drinks, and pastries. Next to that we have Las Crepas, serving different dessert, dessert items including different flavored gelatos, made to order hot, savory, or sweet crepes. Next to that we have another uh, dessert type stand called El Deli, where they serve different sandwiches as well as cakes, cheesecakes, pastries, drinks. Finally, we have Perfect Balance that we uh, visited most often where they serve different 
protein, super green wellness drinks, including wellness shots, and it really made our working out worthwhile. Finally, we have El Italiano, where they serve different fresh pastas for dinner, um, and that we really enjoyed. So again, we really ate a lot, and we took advantage of this uh, marketplace where we were able to eat whatever we wanted. Hey guys. Don't get me in it. This is Homer Simpson's donut. There's a donut shop here, and we found Homer Simpson's donut. <laughs> Pretty good. Really doughy. Get dubs. Get dubs. Get dubs. Get dubs. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. And very smoothie and chocolate smoothie. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm gonna put this first so that June watches our videos. <laughs> June, this is for you. The first clip will be this. Healthy, healthy, healthy. Tell us what each one is. Super greens and pineapple smoothie bowl, seasonal fruit and Greek yogurt bowl. These are the four shots, two reset shots. Reset shots. And two focus shots, which yeah. has spirulina, corella, pearl fill, and pineapple. Post-workout berry smoothie, chocolate super food. Let's start with the shots. Hawaiian coffee. Hawaiian coffee. Cheers. Cheers. Good way to start the day. Wanna try that? No, try this. Try this. Pasta, the fettuccine scampi, pepper adel, and the pizza. Huh? You wanna get a cake? Sure. Later. Okay. I got two crepes. For our dessert, we got the, uh, the cello, strawberry banana, 